A horse named Misty should make a full recovery after being rescued from a frozen lake. Yeah, she looks so sad in there, and it all happened at Mary's Country Critters Petting Zoo in Wayland. Our Michael Martin, though, has the happy ending to that story. Well, it happens every winter. Somebody falls through the ice on a lake or pond, find themselves needing to be rescued. But on Friday, the Allegan County Sheriff's Office and several assisting agencies found themselves responding to a horse stuck in a pond. Thankfully, the officers reacted quickly and even caught the incredible rescue on video. Go. On Friday, police and emergency personnel were called out to a petting zoo in Waylon where they found a roughly 1,200 pound horse named Misty stuck in a frigid pond after falling through the ice. You're all right, girl. I got a call and dispatch told me that there was a horse that went through the ice on a pond which was kind of a shock of a call. Deputy James Kimber, the animal control officer for the Allegan County Sheriff's Office, immediately called Misty's owner, Mary. She thought it was like five inches thick and the horse was up, coming up on her withers, which was is about shoulder height on a horse. I could hear splash, crash, splash. And so I, I looked over here, I walked to the fence and I said, oh no, Misty. Since 2004, Mary has run Mary's Country Critters Petting Zoo from her home. You can see where they cut the ice. It, we came out over here. She says the small pond on her 50 acre property has never been an issue for the horses in the past. Okay, girl. You moving yet? She's wanting to, but I think she knows. You could see ripples coming off of her. She was shaking so bad when you were up close. So I knew she was in, in rough shape. The crew quickly fell back on their training. Everything we've trained for is more of a, a human-based situation. So, but it, you know, we tried to convert it and we were trying to think what's the fastest way to get her out. With 12 years experience on the mounted division, Deputy Kimber kept a close eye on how Misty was holding up throughout the rescue. I think she knew. She just stood stock still, didn't even try to move while they were breaking the ice and waited until we coaxed her and called her by name. In under 15 minutes time, the crew was able to clear enough ice to get Misty out and to safety. Come on. Come on. Get her, get her. There she goes. I did fall as we're trying to get her out, but I knew she knew right where I was at. And <laughs> Good girl. You want to put it uh, in the car? It just worked out. Everything worked out. Misty is doing great. Already back out with the other horses. Two days she was like banging the stall down because halflingers are herd animals. They like to be with the, the rest of their their team. I'm definitely going to stop by and, and say hey to Mary and uh, give Misty a couple extra rubs, you know. <laughs> Definitely. Now again, Misty is expected to make a full recovery. We have more information about the rescue and that video of it all happening on our website at fox17online.com. For now though, in Allegan County, Michael Martin, Fox 17 News. All right, thank you for that, Michael. All's well that ends well yeah. there. We're so happy that Misty's recovering though, I but know. you know, him saying that she was shivering in that ice. Yeah. She held it, yeah. she held in there. Hold your breath right up until the end of the video.